Hey everyone, my name is iMat, welcome back to another video. Today I am showing you what Apple Pay is and how you can use it. So without further ado, let's jump into today's video. Okay, so you're going to need two things to complete this process. An iPhone capable of using Apple Pay, the earliest version of iPhone which supports Apple Pay is iPhone 6, which I have right here, and you're going to need a debit or credit card. So what you're going to want to do to set up Apple Pay is either hit the plus button up here or hit add card. So we're going to hit add card. It'll open up the Apple Pay dialog. Simply hit continue. And if you already have a card on file, you can click next and add that card. But if you have a different card that you'd like to add, this is the exact same card. What you're going to want to do is find your card right here. vibration and it will find your card just like that. So there you have your name and your card number. So simply head next and this is a step that takes a long time. So we're just going to skip ahead. All right so now it will say card verification. Choose how to verify your card for Apple Pay. So you can choose text message, Royal Bank app, well your bank app, or you can call the bank. So I'm going to go Royal Bank app so then I'm going to go next. And then there we go, using Apple Pay. Use Apple Pay wherever you see one of these symbols, the Apple Pay symbol or the contactless symbol. Click continue, and there you go. And it should be verified. There we go. Royal Bank Debit is ready for Apple Pay. Okay, so now that we've gone over all of this, you're probably wondering, okay, you showed me this, how do I pay with Apple Pay? So, easy enough. What you do is double click the home button on the lock screen or in notification center. It'll bring up your wallet application and says pay with touch ID. Right there. So then what you do is you put your touch ID in and it says hold near reader, if you can see that. And once it says hold near reader, simply hold it near the reader and then wait for the check mark. Then the app will automatically close and there you go. You've made your transaction with Apple Pay. Now you're probably wondering, what happens if I lose my phone? Do not be alarmed. Apple Pay is activated by Touch ID, so if you have your fingerprint and that's it into your phone, and no one else knows your password, then you're pretty safe. I wouldn't worry too much about this step. But if there's other people that have their fingerprints in your phone, or they know your password, or they have a way of hacking into your phone, which Apple is pretty secure about that, there is a way that you can remotely remove your card through a computer. So I'm going to show you how to do that just now. Overall, Apple Pay is a really fast and secure and easy way of making payments, so I definitely recommend it to anyone who has an iPhone 6 or later. So I hope you found today's video useful, if you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button if you want more content like this, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, and thank you for watching.